so I'm totally like a Google doctor right now. I feel really bad for him. She went bloop, and then like three tentacles. We have to pee on him. So who do you want to pee on your arm? <laughs> Everything I learned, I learned from friends. <laughs> I did figure out a little pregnancy hack I want to share with you. Alright, it's another day. We did not end yesterday's vlog very good. It was like a chill day on the way and we were just exhausted and we just kind of crashed. This morning we're gonna go back to the beach and we wanted to, you know, enjoy the food of Hawaii too. So we went back to the Hukilau Cafe and got chocolate chip pancakes and macadamia yeah. nut pancakes. And those are huge. That's a big plate. What is this, day four, day, three, five? I don't even know. Day two close to going home. Thursday, yeah. Two That's days. what today is. But we decided to come to the beach first thing this morning. I think Pounders is our favorite beach. I still think so. Yep. We've been to other ones, we've been to some new ones that we liked. If you look back here, it's just all pretty. So pretty. And the other ones like have houses and stuff and those are pretty, they're pretty houses but. Today's gonna be mostly a beach day. We're gonna go to the beach this morning. Then we're going to go to a surf town. I wanna check out a ukulele shop there and just check out the cool surf town. And then tonight we're gonna take some family Ooh, pictures on the beach. That was a big one. That was big. Bentley's face shows how big Yeah, and Ella ran. <laughs> so the waves are bigger today, but the kids wanted to play in the waves, so that's fun too. Hope you've enjoyed our family vacation to Hawaii so far. Make sure you like and subscribe because we're not done yet. We still got a couple more days left to see what we enjoy here in beautiful Hawaii. Four kids taking on the waves together. So Bentley just came in from the water. And he says his arm is stinging and I'm not quite sure what it is. It's definitely like raised and bumpy right there. So we took a picture of it and we're gonna watch it for a little bit. Just like 10 or 15 minutes and see if it gets bigger or smaller or how it changes. But how does it feel? Like when I was in the water, it like really hurt. I think it was because of the salt water. There's definitely something there. Like he's definitely not making that up, that's for sure. So, so I'm totally like a Google doctor right now. But I'm pretty sure he got stung by a jellyfish. Looking at pictures, it's obviously not severe. It's just like a little one. Luckily, everything said that the that stinging pain should only last like an hour or two, especially based on the size of his. I feel really bad for him. That can't be fun. How, how are you doing, Bentley? It kind of feels like I stuck that part in like, like really hot water. He's onto like that burning. Not like boiling, but like hot. Show you kind of a close up of it again to see if it's changed at all. This is why, you know, Doctor of Alley thinks it's a jellyfish because this is all raised, and then you can see like a red strip right there and a red strip right there, and then one going down his elbow, so a red strip right there. So I think it it was probably just like a little jellyfish. It went bloop, and then like three tentacles around. Ah, poor guy. Bentley's trying to keep his mind off of the sting, so the kids are gonna go check out this really cool fort. But he was walking away, and I noticed this on the other side of his arm. Poor guy, he's like going, you know, to get his mind off of it, and I'm like, oh, look, you know. It totally wraps around his arm. So I'm thinking that Bentley got stung by a so jellyfish. Bentley, you know what they say, if you get stung by a jellyfish, right? We have to pee on it. So who do you want to pee on your arm? Do you want to pee on it or you want me to pee on it? Mom said that's not very accurate. <laughs> that's true. Well, we did look it... it up and it said that's not very accurate. But everybody has heard that. That if you get stuck by jellyfish, because it was on a Friends episode once.
That's right, I stepped up. If we had to pee on it, what would you want to pee on? Honey. <laughs> That'd be really hard to pee on your arm, though. <laughs> you can do it. All right. Fair enough. Megan just got here. What happened? Did you pee on it? <laughs> <laughs> Everything I learned, I learned from friends. If I had to, I'd pee on any one of you. I did figure out a little pregnancy hack I want to share with you. So I'm just at that point where I just can't lay on my stomach anymore. But when you're at the beach, you kind of lay on your tummy. I just dug a little spout from my belly. It doesn't have to be very big. And then you put your towel on top. And then you can lay out. Genius. It really did. Alright, go put that one away. Come on, Maddie. You wanna go in or no? That's a big one. You're good, you're good. Is that a fun one? <laughs> yeah, that was a big one. <laughs> I thought that was a big one. Yeah, there's a fun one. Look how beautiful that is though, huh? Wow. Isn't it beautiful? Kids are loving the beach. So are the parents. There's a big one. It's okay, I'll get this. It's a mini group of mommy. It looks like they spent a lot of time on it. It's like they dug it out. It's like a legit hiding spot. Like. Fun and trying, fun and trying to get on this rope line. Walk across it. Oh, it fell! It fell, and we gotta try another one now. Finally made it to Papa Ole. It's just one of my favorite places to eat here. It's really weird though. We have to call our order in even here outside. We brought him back to the house. And Bentley wants to try shrimp. There we go. Mom's gonna de-shell it. Can I try a little bit of that one? It's okay. Can I try a little bit of that one? It's okay. 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 I like it, but I don't really like the texture. I got the garlic chicken. It looks kind of weird, but it's real, real, real tasty. Aliyeva! I love you, Daddy, because I have so many. 
I love you too, Ella. Just because you're you. Yeah, Holly Ava for being a surf chat. I don't see any waves. <laughs> we stopped at these cute little shops and I'm checking out Bentley's arm and it looks really good. I can barely see right there where it was raised. And then around it, you can just kind of see the the one stinger thing right there. So it looks really good, buddy. Why are you sad? I'm just really tired and my throat's hurting. You need water. Can I get you water? Yeah. Drink up, buttercup. Dang, we just had to get gas for the first time here. Luckily it was the first time, but see how much that is? 387 a gallon. We just dropped over $60. We were down to a quarter of a tank, so that wasn't even from empty, and over $60 to put gas in here. But luckily it's a small island, we haven't had to drive that far, cause dang. She's been giving me a hard time for it. <laughs> She's all, I'm pro, I'm pro. Wait, 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 I'm pro. Don't get it in the grease. Okay, there you go. Right by the air, Phillips can. <laughs> wait, you are a cheat, you're perfect. Ah, ah. It's not like a rain rain. <laughs> oh, Ella's doing pretty good. But well, we're at our favorite shave ice place, Willy Willy's Plantation Cafe. How bad could it be? All these great flavors. But you gotta get it with the ice cream. Woo! Willy Willy's Shave Ice. The best. This is Tiger's Blood. All right. Her favorite root beer. All right, here, Bentley, come hold this one. All right, Macy, what do you have? I don't know. Halpia, which is coconut. The secret though, see this? This is condensed milk on top, and there's a scoop of ice cream at the bottom. And Bentley, you've got root beer. It's just straight root beer. <laughs> Lennon, you got tiger's blood. And again, ice cream and on the bottom. I, and, my, and, and Ella, we're just sharing all of them, huh? I got rainbow magical. Rainbow magic. This is our favorite treat on the island. It's right next to Seven Brothers Best at the mill. There's a peacock. There's a peacock, you're right. There is a big old peacock in his. That's a big peacock. Oh my gosh, there's a freaking peacock. I've never seen a peacock before. Hey crew, so it's the end of the night. Well, it's evening now, and my awesome niece Cameron, it's in her name, Camera, right there. My awesome niece Cameron is like a photographer on the side. And so I was like, hey Cameron, your favorite uncle has his family in Hawaii. You wanna take some family pictures of us? And she was super gracious and was like, yeah, I'd love to do that. So we came to this beach over here by Turtle Bay and we took some fun family pictures. 
So we're super excited to see how those turn out. She's awesome. I told her she needs to start doing this like as a side gig because she lives here. Her, her and her husband go to BYU, Idaho. You're always looking for extra money, so side gig photographer take family pictures or just couples pictures or anybody's pictures. So if you're in Hawaii, let me know. We'll tell you get the hookup. She can do some awesome pictures for you and your family. Isn't this place beautiful? Isn't it beautiful? Now we're probably just gonna call it an early night because I think I'm gonna take a couple kids on a pretty hard hike in the morning. How's that? We just finished taking family pictures and it just started to rain on us and the wind picked up, the storm moving in. Perfect timing. It's not the end of the world. Today, can you see it? We got a beautiful story.